water showers out there impacting the Treasure Coast in Okeechobee County and now entering the Palm Beaches this early morning. It is going to be rainy at least for the next couple of hours across the state of Florida. I am tracking light to moderate showers still impacting Indian River County out towards Fort Drum, Fort Bassinger and Okeechobee. All this light rain will be heading towards Fort Pierce, Port St. Lucie very shortly and even down into Palm City as well. More right behind that, so it is going to be rainy at least for the next one or two hours out there. Down into Martin County and the Palm Beaches, light to moderate showers impacting Jupiter Farms, down into the Turnpike area, Wellington, Delray Beach, Boynton Beach, seeing some light showers, and even out towards Belle Glade and Pahokee, still raining, and we are going to see more rain right behind that. So by 9, 10 o'clock in the morning, we may see some light to moderate showers, lots of cloud coverage out there, so just expect mostly cloudy conditions all day on your Friday, part of your Saturday as well. A few pockets of heavy rains impacting our area. We could get a break of the rain after 12 o'clock in the afternoon, according to this model, and other models are agreeing with it as well. And then we'll see another round for some rains, steady rains, a few pockets of heavy rains that may lead to street flooding as well. Heavy rains by uh, 5, 6 o'clock in the evening, and then it will continue to rain overnight while we're sleeping. And then when you wake up at 5, 6 o'clock in the morning, still raining out there, and a few pockets of light to moderate showers around 10, 11 o'clock in the morning, just a very soggy start on your Saturday and then the front will be clearing us out completely Saturday afternoon by 1, 2 o'clock in the afternoon. We'll finally see some sunshine trying to peek through across the Treasure Coast. Some lingering showers out there in Stewart and even down into Broward County. Then on Saturday evening, just a few light showers and we'll see more um, clouds building in than clear skies eventually overnight on Saturday. So storm impacts for today and part of your Saturday will be heavy rains and steady rains out there. Gusty winds up to 30 miles per hour. The potential for some lightning strikes and localized flooding. Not everyone will see some pounding on the roadways. Winds right now up to 22 miles per hour, very gusty down into Boca and Boynton Beach, close to 25. We are going to see that wind advisory in effect starting at 12 o'clock until tomorrow night. That means winds over 30 miles per hour near our coastal areas. Temperatures now in the 60s and the lower 70s. It will stay that way pretty much all day long. Temperatures no low to mid 70s and impact weather all day. So make sure you pack that umbrella on your Friday and part of your Saturday. Your seven day forecast will see drier conditions Saturday afternoon and your Sunday looks perfect with a lot of sunshine, a little bit cooler. Temperatures will be in the 50s and the lower 60s when you wake up Sunday morning and then milder on Monday and Tuesday. Another cold front on Wednesday and Thursday with more rain in the forecast and temperatures back to normal near 79 degrees.